The famous Brennan's restaurant has reopened its doors on Royal Street. This comes after more than a year of renovations and some controversy. A family dispute led to the eviction of the previous owner, Pip Brennan. Anchor Sully Kim has more on this morning's ceremony and the rebirth of the iconic restaurant. The much anticipated reopening of a New Orleans staple happened in grand fashion. <laughs> Co owners Ralph Brennan and Terry White thanked guests as the brass letters Brennan's were unveiled. Excited beyond words. We've uh, been working at the renovation for over a year, and it, it's just a joy to be a part of re, the rebirth, really, of this fantastic old building. The restaurant has reemerged after months of repositioning and renovations. After some family squabble, a bankruptcy court forced the Brennan's business to sell its remaining assets. That's when White and Brennan took over and worked to reopen its doors. We, we were able to take possession of the property. We just determined that it needed an extensive renovation, more extensive actually than we thought at the time. The kitchen's completely redesigned, and so we have all brand new equipment, state of the art equipment. Though some features are new, the restaurant will maintain its tradition with their signature favorites. We're also going to have, uh, you know, all of the, the eggs, egg dishes, eggs Benedict, trout Nancy, and so all the old favorites. But we've also got uh, Slade rushing up. Fantastic chef has got some new surprises and twists on some of those dishes. On your side, Salah Kim, WDSU News. Brennan's restaurant first opened back in 1956 on Royal Street, that exact address, 417 Royal.